in this exercise we will be making person model db a singleton class so that there is only one object of its type which connects to the database now every language have its own way of creating the uh, singleton class basically the concept is very simple you have to create a static reference in a class and you have to check against that static reference in a constructor whether this static reference is already allocated or not if it's already allocated you will result into an exception if it's not you will create and go ahead while creating one static method so we'll be creating one so you, you cannot declare static variable directly so you need to declare a static variable using a struct c struct so we give the name as static okay now every language have its own way of creating a static variables so in swift we create static variable only through using struct so i've created two static variable one is instance of type person db model and one is once token which is a dispatch once t now there is a something called gcd inside the ios which stands for grand central dispatch now this is basically used for managing the threads so threads management becomes easier with gcd now suppose you create a static method it has a potential that two threads can attack that method simultaneously so in that case there will be two objects created now with dispatch once t it will make sure that even though there are two threads attacking the method at the same time only one thread will get executed the other one won't get executed so this will make sure that only one object exists so dispatch once t is important to make sure that your singleton is thread safe now i'll create one static method called class function so we always create static using a class so we'll give them the name shared instance okay and we'll be creating okay so in the sh class method share instance we are calling dispatch once okay so whatever you write in this block or in the closure will get executed only once even though there are plenty of thread attacking this function at the same time it will execute only once in the life cycle so you know your static instance will get created only once in the life cycle of your app and if it's already and every time when you call this method it will return that static instance of type person model now you need to just check so when a constructor get called you need to make sure that there is no other way a user can only get a reference of this person db model only through calling shared instance but if you try to allocate and call the constructor you need to write an assert statement which is a conditional log stating if an instance is nil then only you can go to next line else you have to print the appropriate message saying attempt to create a second instance of person db model so that will come as a console output and your app will get crashed so this is the way we create singleton class we first create a static variable using structure we always declare one dispatch once t dispatch q which will execute only once we we'll create a class method and we'll call the dispatch q in that static method where they create their instance and in a constructor we write the asset statement now in next exercise we'll create a connection from the controller to this provider try to execute all this method and check whether the data is getting insert in a database or not and once we are assured that the model is proper we'll start getting that data into the view